Special lighting is necessary to produce the UVB wavelengths. Between all the technologies, mercury vapor, LED, and fluorescent bulbs, it is the fluorescent bulbs that is the most used. Now within fluorescent bulbs, there actually is a great diversity. And so we need to pick a, a shape of bulb. We need to pick a technology. We need to pick a, a power of UVB. So in all of this, I'm gonna make it easy for you. The most functional UVB bulb for an adult size cage is a linear T5. And when we say linear, what we mean is a long tube. Compact fluorescent lighting takes that tube and it bends it over in itself so it fits into a standard light socket, but that's not what we want. So we want the long tube. We want the T5 technology. Don't get T8 technology, get the T5 technology. That's the newest and the brightest. And then finally, you're going to have to figure out the strength of UVB that you want. I recommend the Reptisun 5.0, the Arcadia 6%, or the Leap 5.0. And you'll be able to look on my care summaries to see exactly how to position that and how far away from the basking branch. So yes, finding the right UVB bulb can be challenging, but I hope that all the information that you get this week will make it an easier thing to do. In the next episode, I'm going to go over how we measure UVB intensity. Follow the Chameleon Academy for the entire series, and I will see you tomorrow.